they're just a little over two weeks old now. It's a great morning. We got sunshine and the babies look like they're hungry little guys. <laughs> How wonderful is this? Look at all the wonderful markings on, on her face. She got the black marks and the cheek stripes and her sear. These little guys, look how energetic they are. All lined up in a row there, all four of them. <laughs> this is just wonderful. We've been kind of keeping track on them in different stages, but uh, it's been uh, about three days since we've been here. We decided to come up this morning and see what we can find, and we're very happy to get here at this time you now with the babies having their feet. I didn't see her uh, bring it in. I was getting set up. But this is really wonderful. One a wonderful irie to make videos of. Right at Suquamish Falls. It's always beautiful here. A wonderful natural setting for the peregrine falcon and their chicks. We got a good angle on today because Usually she's standing in front of them, so this time they're, uh, she's on the back side and they're all lined up in a row. You can't get any better than that. I'm all excited about this one. I was kind of looking around for the male. I haven't seen him, but I'm sure he's not far away. See what she brought in, but you know it's got to be a good-sized prey to feed all four of these guys now. Oh yeah, they're energetic. We have a nest of Cooper hops. We're going to be uh, making videos of also down in uh, Renton, Washington. They haven't hatched out yet, so we do uh, many different birds of prey. We have bald eagles also that we uh, make videos of. And uh, the eagle nest that we're watching in Renton, bald eagle nest, uh, they've hatched, but they're too small. We haven't been able to get a view of them. Once they get big enough to lift their heads over, we'll be able to see it. We're getting a little bit of mist going by, but it's not bad. So I just I went down and checked on the bald eagle nest this morning and nothing going on, so I came up here and I'm sure glad I did. Look at these guys. <laughs> they're totally enjoying their breakfast. They look really healthy here. Like I say, they're just over two weeks old now. has got them breakfast going here and the male's out hunting again. Takes a lot of food at this nesting stage. Feed four babies this size plus mama and then himself. Oh yeah. We did a series on the prairie falcon last year over on Canyon Road between Ellensburg and Yakima. And we were able to make that video from the time that she was incubating the eggs till they hatched till they flew away. So we went over there about every two days, two or three days. We plan to do that with these here. Is, uh, come up by every th two or three days and see the progress and uh, we'll make some good videos of it. Here the falls is flowing pretty good. Uh, the weather's warmed up and it's snow melt, so we're getting quite a bit of water through here now. I have no idea what she brought. But I'm zoomed. 
zoomed in as far as I can. It's about 160 yards from where I'm at to the nest. So we have got a good spot here. It's a good angle. And they've got what is the critter zoom set up. Critter zoom peregrine falcon. You just go to critterzoom.com and you can find it. And they're shooting about the same angle as I am now. It's only down about 50 feet from me. So at the same elevation so all right let's see what she's gonna do now oh yeah looks like she's gonna fly out of here looks like she's thinking about oh yeah checking a few things out here look at these wonderful babies she's such a good mama look at it <laughs> this is really great She'll look for any kind of a little scrap thing and she'll haul that away. Anything needs to be hauled out of there, she'll do it. We got all her babies right there next to her. Look at that, would you? Well, I think she wants to snuggle up there with them a little bit. She must be thinking it's a little bit cool yet. Get over here next to Mama. And I'll warm you up a little bit. I say it's in the morning now and uh, it's not really that warm and she's a little bit concerned about it so all right you little guys come over here next to mom and they're happy to do that but the stage they're at now a little over uh, two weeks they can uh, Kind of regulate their body temperature themselves now. They, they do need a little help yet if it's too cold, but they're doing just great. She knows exactly what she's doing. Now when their little primary feathers get about eight of an inch long, then they will not need her heat anymore. They can regulate their own body temperature. They're actually kind of doing that now when the weather's warm. But she decided, well, it's a little bit cool. I'll just kind of help them out a little bit. What a beautiful setting. All this at a great scenic site, Suquamish Falls. Ah, she finished up eating. Now she's just kind of babysitting. Don't look like the little guys want to stay under her, so they want to play around a little bit. thing about keeping them warm but they don't look like they're they're kind of cleaning up the beak got any more food <laughs> they are sure energetic this morning we're getting a wonderful view of this we're at a good angle today oh yeah there's a couple of them snuggling up the mama and see the little eyes little dark eyes there they're getting around pretty good look how big their feet are already need big feet and they grab their prey it's got some long toes on there the bird was used for falconry years ago because they're so fast and such great hunters They've been used in falconry for about who knows four or five thousand years I guess they do a lot of falconry in Asia and Europe yet we have several clubs here in the United States that are in good. They've been very helpful in uh, having uncontaminated breeding stock when they brought these birds back from extinction, on the verge of extinction. So that helped out good because their birds were not contaminated with the DDT. Well, let's see what she's doing now. She's kind of walking back over here. And I think she just flew out. Yep, there she goes. Well, let's see what the little guys are going to do now. Kind of snuggling in there. Well, here's our three little guys. 
looking around. I saw looks like mama's coming in with some food here. Oh yeah, she landed right in there and she's feeding them. She's got her head down. Let's we'll see what she's brought. How exciting is this? Oh yeah. What a great movie this is. Look at the marks on her face there, the little cheek stripes, and the little guys are getting their markings too. It looks like a bird. She's plucking feathers, looks like. I don't think, yeah, I think it is feathers. She caught a bird. Well, I'm not sure if it's either the male or the female that brought the food. But anyway, we're all excited about it. We came over today, oh yeah. They're just having a good time feeding these guys. Look at that. Handing one off there. Look at this. I don't know. It's a small bird, I think. These guys require a lot of food at this stage because they grow. Look at him. This guy's mouth's going, give me a bite. Oh, yeah. He's just chowing out. Next one gets a little bite there. She's uh, handing out pretty good. They're all getting the share there. Oh, yeah, what great lighting we have today. We're doing just great. We've been hoping to get a movie of this, and uh, it looks like everything worked out just fine. It's an excellent idea. It just pays to have a little patience setting up some little tedious, but I think we got it focused pretty good this time, and uh, this is exactly... Oh, look at the one behind there. Hey, what about me? Mom said, get over here on this side if you want to get in line. <laughs> oh, yeah, I got a great shot here. I'm going to let it run till the full feeding session and hopefully we'll see them take off. It doesn't look like a big bird, but she's really working. I'm going to have a little snack himself. Look at that. they will take a little of that for me. <laughs> oh, yeah. What a great day to be making a video of a prairie falcon along the Yakima River. This is absolutely fantastic. Yeah, he's behind there. Looks like he's hollering a little bit. She's looking around, checking around the back there. He says, well, I got to have a little bite too there. She's looking for any little specks. So she's going to give him a little bite. Maybe she, oh, maybe they look for scraps to carry away on cleanup. I think that's what's going on. All right, now I think the feeding's almost done. Looking around, see what happens here. Maybe we'll get the takeoff. What a beautiful bird. Look at that. Oh, fantastic. Well, we go, hey, where'd you go? And they sure are looking happy. Look how bright their eyes are. We got some happy babies here. Just got food delivered right to us. That was great. Yeah, the three little heads looking out, having a good time. <laughs> oh, yeah, we're all excited about it. Got birds singing down here. And Oh yeah, this one's coming up the front to stretch now and look over the edge. This has been a terrific day. We have really got some good footage today. These are our three prairie falcon youngsters growing as fast as they can. We come, like I say again, every three days and the growth is phenomenal. You cannot believe the difference a three day makes with these babies. This is a fantastic video. I'll just let it run here. Looks like his little crop under his beak there is swelled out, so he's got plenty to eat. So I'll be waiting for the next round of food, I guess. So. But they're at this stage here. They're just looking really healthy. Oh, yeah. yeah I got the one in the front looking and two of them behind them there. <laughs> Like I said earlier, we think one of these is uh, probably a little male, Tiersel, because he's smaller. That one in the front's definitely the female. They're more aggressive and bigger. And they're sure happy about that little feeding session. Well, we'll let it run a little bit there and see what happens. Yeah, now he's just cleaning up a few of the scraps there. It looks like they're kind of settling down there, so... We've got three happy little prairie falcons here. 
Yep. Whenever they can get fed like that, they're happy. Well, it looks like they're settling down a little bit now and scratching up, so let's call that good then. Enjoy the video.